Welcome to Field Tech Focus. The construction industry is evolving rapidly, driven by groundbreaking technological advancements. Traditional methods are being replaced by smarter, faster, and more sustainable solutions. In today's video, we'll explore cutting-edge technologies and innovative techniques that are transforming the way we build. Some of these might surprise you. You may be seeing them for the very first time. The versatile Perry Alpha construction kit is particularly helpful for building bridges and tunnels. It can be used to erect shoring towers or support structures for bridge parapets. The Alpha kit is easy to build since it eliminates the need for stripped threads by using pins rather than bolts. The components are lightweight enough to be pre-assembled without a crane and robust enough to form trusses up to 28 meters in length making it simpler to fasten a pin with a hammer hit than to tighten the bolt. Join the future of construction. Today is the message Hilti is trying to convey with Mark Holes and Jbot, their first drill-equipped robot. Jbot operates in a semi-autonomous manner. The user guides it to the target area via a remote control after which the robot takes over. Because of the BM model data and its compatibility with the automated Hilti PLT300 tachometer, it is extremely exact while drilling marking all the holes it can reach on its own. According to Hilti, Jiboat is designed to address the lack of qualified labor and improve safety on construction sites. It is electric, with a full charge lasting up to eight hours, and it even has an integrated dust extractor system. How do you feel about this type of technology? Since WoodTech Element Bottish modules are made with CNC machines, they have a very smooth finish that makes it easy to spot even the smallest misalignment of the mounted parts. The standard module is one and a half by three meters and can be connected to other modules of the same size. The final size of the table depends only on the client's budget and the space available in the workshop. The table's entire grid is a handy feature that you can use to set up jacks and other tools making it easy to work efficiently even by yourself. Try the Timo Concrete Temperature Control System if you want to expedite construction and save money. This technology allows you to monitor the strength of the mixture in real time, prevent thermal cracking, and fine-tune mixtures to reduce their carbon footprint. Timo Foundation is 30% faster. The sensors in the system send data continuously, eliminating the need for destructive tests like sending cement cubes to a lab. The data is sent wirelessly, so the supervisor doesn't need to be on site. All the information is sent directly to a computer or a phone. Simple system setup involves first calibrating the mix in the lab, then attaching sensors to the rebar and connecting them to measurement nodes once the concrete is poured at the proper temperature. Strength are tracked right away. Here are some wonderful developments for the environment and builders. When creating reinforced concrete slabs, a team from Zurich University of Applied Sciences has developed a workable formwork system called Unfold Form that can cut the amount of concrete used by up to 60% and the amount of steel used by up to 90%. Its clever design is the key. The 24 kilogram Unfold Form prototype can support a ton of concrete. Here's a fun fact. The materials to create it cost $714. Do you think it's a fair price? The formwork is built of thin, flexible plywood strips that expand like a fan. Leave a comment with your ideas. Ceramitex facades not only adhere to all building requirements, but also protect garden homes from natural disasters, ensuring that any structure retains its architectural integrity for as long as feasible. 
This method uses long-lasting Ceramitex tiles that are between 6 and 8 millimeters thick. Ceramitex tiles are perfect for projects with right angles because of their seamless construction, which produces a continuous, smooth, monolithic exterior that is resistant to graffiti, bright sunlight, and scratches. There are countless color choices, and bespoke colors can be requested for orders of 20,000 tiles or more. Thermal bridges can form when balconies, parapets, and other building components aren't constructed carefully. This implies that heat can escape outdoors through the link between, say, a balcony and a slab, which might result in issues like mold or concrete cracks. In order to isolate these components from the building's thermal circuit, builders utilize thermal insulation systems. In the video, shaked isocore thermal insulation is utilized for connections between concrete and concrete. This solution addresses the thermal bridge problem at the parapet. Additional reinforcements are not required, and the insulation can be installed either before or during the concrete pouring process. Australia has created a show-fire strategy for marketing beautiful concrete. The idea is straightforward. Rather than using boring grey gravel, why not use the advancements in the mining industry? It's important to note that Australia exports minerals to more than 100 nations. The manufacturer promises that the gorgeous concrete in the video will stay cool underfoot, even during the sweltering Australian summers making it ideal for garages or poolside areas. Furthermore, the surface is non-slip since the stones are natural. Nonetheless, each project may differ somewhat from batch to batch. Up to 60% of the world's raw materials, including wood, metals and minerals, are used in the construction industry. This is where the NPS Flex system comes into play. A building constructed with it has a lifespan of many years, at which point it can be disassembled and its parts recovered for reuse. Furthermore, projects utilizing NPS Flex can reduce on-site labor by 80% and buildings are completed 40% faster, so there are many advantages. But perhaps you see a drawback. Please share your opinions in the comments section. With an incredible capacity of 86,000, the River Plate Stadium in Argentina is not only the biggest stadium in Argentina, but all of South America. It should come as no surprise that it hosts both football matches and concerts, with well-known acts like ACDC Metallica and Lady Gaga Grace its stage. However, with so many people, how does the stadium's turf hold up? Vasari's modular surfacing system, which is composed of tiles in different sizes, like 1.2 by 2.4 meters, can support a load of about 41 tons per square meter. In addition, this system can be used to protect almost any area where large crowds are anticipated, not just stadiums.